Hey, I'm back with a new piece. This one's called Blue Gecko. Can you see the gecko? As soon as it was pointed out to me, I said, hey, that's where I gotta name it. Come on, you can see it, right? Leg, gecko's head, gecko's body, tail, toe it. That was not my intention when I was painting it, but I like it, I like the free flow of it. Um, now, there's some couple interesting things about this piece. That is uh, different from other pieces. One, as you've already noticed, there is no frame on this. Um, I like that. I did it purposely for this piece because I really like the frayed edges. I wanted that look, and if I was going to frame it because of the odd skewed uh, shape of the canvas, I was going to end up having to cut off the part of the paint itself. So one, you have anti-traditionalism going on, which in my case is anytime you can get away, you can break out of the mold of what typical and expected is. Um, you're making progress. Number two, um, I don't know how well you can see from there, but this particular area and also here the paint continues off the main background and that's good it creates a continuous continuity so there are two aspects that i don't have i don't have edge intimidation and i don't have your typical square 90 degree corners um i personally balance the the x and y axis off my signature line. So when that strays, zip the top of the canvas and also the lower half of the canvas should be tilted slightly. This is great because it always will bring a reaction out to people. First thing they might notice is, hey, it's crooked. No, it's not. That's the way it's supposed to be. Um, but I love this double canvas. It's kind of a canvas on a canvas. Um, you got a little bit of a uh, tail here, and you got another little bit of a tail hanging off here of the thread. And it gives a very uh, natural, visceral effect to it. I really like this piece. For, to be honest, I don't want to get rid of it, but uh, money's a real motivator. So uh, throw some money in my face and it's yours. Anyway. Um, more info, you can find out directly below this video if you're on YouTube, you're in the description area, and more about the site and how to find out about this piece, and more about me. So, the Blue Gecko. Enjoy.